Well, let's just compare, compare and contrast uh, Sir Robert's uh, luggage to very compact bags. And there's my luggage, which to me looks twice the size, or twice as large, it contains twice as much stuff. How has he done it? I didn't pack any, I didn't pack any cookies, apparently. Well, no, you didn't think to pack any snacks. I would suggest that's maybe the answer. Whereas my bags are, my bags are bulging. Your bags are going to be full of crumbs. most of the way towards Watford Junction at the moment. I'm worried about your uh, shoelace. It's fine. Just make sure you film it so I trip o when I trip over so uh, we have a viral YouTube clip. Coach C. Don't you start doing that yet. I'm not ready, I'm not presentable. <laughs> well, you're perfectly presentable. I thought we were going to do this later when we're all... Uh, a bit well, sick of so just tell them, we've decided who's going to be on top. Well, uh, uh, this was always going to be the, uh, um, uh, a bit of a critical moment in our, uh, this week's uh, relationship. Would be Who would be going on top and who would be going on bottom? Yes. Um, in the end, we had to uh, toss for it. <laughs> I broke, well, me, and I'm going to be going on top, which... Uh, <laughs> is, that a I, is that a new no, thing for that's you? Not, no, I, I'm, <laughs> that's something which I uh, feel very comfortable with. And, uh, well, do you want to give the tour of the, uh, of the cabin? Or, uh, or berth? Or well, compartment? Or? Uh, let's do that later. I'm still a little bit discombobulated. Oh, well. <laughs> let's recombobulate then. I will, I will cut here. Cheers. I wonder why you're enjoying it. Looks a bit like piss, actually. What? That's it's a bit like piss. That's quite no, it's, thank it's got, you. It's got very flat. <laughs> well, you did insist I drink it slow. Yeah, yeah, same. Just giving a, a, a viewer a taste of the lounge car. <laughs> what do you think I was doing? After you went on about that guy. Yeah, th thanks for mentioning that. I <laughs> thought you were going to use the Zoom. Oh, honestly. Anyway, here, here's all the. Um, this is this is the most important item of the whole trip. Oh, who could that be knocking at the door? Oh! Hi there! Hello. Would you like to tell me and the viewing several uh, a little bit about this room that we're sharing? Well, we are ensconced, as it were, in uh, our berth in the uh, Fort William sleeper. As you can see, um, I think an estate agent would describe it as uh, bijou, possibly. 
or cosy or some other euphemism but uh, it's very very comfortable um, obviously we have full uh, clothes hanging facilities here um, a mirror should you wish to admire yourself and uh, I will be at some point um, Oh, well, you, that's part of the course, I would have thought. Well, yes. Full uh, full lighting control. For, uh... Oh, Rob, oh, don't do that. Oh, no, I was trying to make a cheap joke there about when the lights went out. Oh, okay. Well, no, no, forget it. Oh, go on, do the cheap joke. Oh, wait, oof, ow, oof, no. That was no good. <laughs> well, let's start. <laughs> Sorry. No, no. Do it, it was, again. Uh, no, it was a very good joke. No, it's a load of rubbish. It's it a good joke. I, I, I appreciate it. Um, and um, uh, obviously, uh, come on, well, that, that's get with it. it. That's about it. Really. Well, let's have a look yeah. at some of the other features. Well, we have, we have. Uh, I'll just move my uh, phone out of the way. We have full, uh, full sink facilities, and this tap properly operated will provide water. Properly operate as opposed to improperly operated. Well, Bl a blind? A blind, yes. Um, sure. Again, properly operated. <laughs> Pro properly operated will um, Some water. prevent light from entering. <laughs> Much like uh, David Cameron. Um, what? <laughs> and um, if you if you look behind you, we have the uh, fold down tray where you may store perhaps a nice cup of tea or some sort of breakfast material. That's for my use because I am. You are on top, on, yes. as it were. I get this extra facility. No, I've got a tray as well. Uh, oh, right. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. Have I have I ruined all the no, illusions? I thought, for I thought you that now? was just. No, I do have a tray as well. I'm okay. sorry to say. So, overall impressions of the uh, well. Speaking, I'm, I'm going to channel the spirit of um, a very famous Michael, who is well, well known for his railway journeys of Palin. Michael Portillo. I'm channeling. Uh, I'm my preferences for uh, Palin over Portillo any day. Ah. Um, I would uh, sum this up as being um, slightly cleaner and tidier than perhaps I was expecting. But also, what? No, I, I, I just like that you had low expectations. And but but also um, slightly smaller than I was expecting. Um, well, I always think it's it's good to uh, reduce your expectations to the bare minimum, because then you will always be pleasantly surprised. Ah. Um, I'm looking forward to what the <laughs> what the night may bring. <laughs> in terms, okay. no, in terms of. Um, Travelling through the night, it's always uh, a bit of a um, going into the unknown because it's such an atypical experience. Um, but uh, I, I'm already uh, fully expecting not to get hardly any sleep at all uh, and to be woken up by plenty of banging and shunting uh, in the small hours. Uh, but when you're sharing a room with Robin, then Robin? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it was going so well up to that point. Shall we do that bit again? Um, no, we'll we'll leave it in. No, because it looks stupid. It makes me look I, I'll, stupid. I will no. I will change my name by deed poll to Robert. to Robin. To um, you were just thinking of Batman. Yes. Well, you're wearing a superhero t-shirt. Yes. Still, this is... is it still filming? Yes. No. Oh. <laughs> so. Well, I was just trying to make a cheap innuendo. Uh, are, are there any other kinds of innuendo? Anyway, um, I think uh, we might venture back out again later to see whether it's quieted down in the lounge car because, quite frankly, there was a bunch of hideous people in there earlier um, <laughs> uh, hooting and braying and behaving with a staggering amount of um, uh, coarseness. 
uh, feet on the seats, bellowing. One guy had his feet on the seats. But he was wearing a pair of red trousers. Nothing wrong. Well, maybe maybe well, when he was wearing If them. you can carry them off, then that's fine, but he should have been carried <laughs> off. The train. You, you think he couldn't pull off a pair of red trousers? There's a very, only a few people who can. Uh, and he wasn't one of them. Uh, and he had his feet up on the seats as well. I mean, and that, for me, if I see someone with their feet on the seat, then what's it? That's it. There's no rationality goes out the window. Uh, any other redeeming features that they have are completely overruled. Anyway, I'm just babbling now. Yes, I think I think that appropriate point of fate to black. I think. 